I think about exercising the same way I think about playing video games. You don't have time to do it. You make time. Hi, everybody. It's Andy Barrar, a.k.a. Handy Andy, your DIY tech guy. And today we're going to be looking at a fitness tech product. This one is from a company called MSAN Fitness, and we're looking at their electronic skipping rope with fitness tracker. Now, when I kind of set this all up, I did like this system, but I didn't think I would have a good jump rope session. It just felt different from the jump rope that I used. And this cable just seemed to get, I thought it was going to get tangled in my feet. But boy, was I wrong. Not only could I jump at the same speed I was with my other jump rope, but I could do all the different types of moves with my feet with this rope. And a lot of it has to do with setting the right uh, length. And what you want to do is you step on the rope and you put each rope sides and they should go up to your armpit and that's when you know you're at the right length and once I did that I had no issue using this jump rope and doing all the different types of footwork that I've learned over the past six months and I got a really good workout another thing I noticed was the fact that I was tracking the workout that just made me want to do better and it, if you've ever worn a smartwatch you know what that feels like when you're trying to hit your step goal i just really wanted to get good data so i was just giving her uh during the session i can imagine my heartbeat was just going through the roof during that workout now i want to talk a little bit about the pros and cons of this rope now the pro i really love the fact that it has that built-in fitness tracker because Having that data collected while you're jumping rope just kind of motivates you to want to do better and then you can measure each workout. So you, what you'll notice is that you might be uh, jumping rope faster for a certain period of time, your rotations are going faster. And if your rotations are going faster, that means you're burning more calories. So I thought that on, on the surface is a really good pro. It makes sense to put a fitness tracker in a jump rope. Another thing I liked about it was that it was super light. You know, one thing about ropes is then some you have weighted ropes and some aren't, but it felt comfortable in the hand. I didn't really have much issues. I was, however, pressing these buttons by accident while I was jumping. Oh, see, I just did it right there. I turned it on. But I think they have a mode where it doesn't affect it. Once it understands that it's going through the rotations, it doesn't really move. Uh, another thing I liked was the whole system of putting the rope onto the handle itself. It's super easy and you can adjust the length on the fly, which can help you find that perfect length for your jump roping uh, experience at that particular time. Now, in terms of cons, well, I don't think this fitness tracker is very accurate because it told me in about a 10 minute and 53 jump rope session that I burned about 529 calories. And that's for someone at my weight. And all the data that I looked online doesn't suggest that that is accurate. In fact, I think it's almost double of what I burned. I probably burned about 200, maybe 250 calories, not 529. And trust me, I would love to burn, have burned that much in about 10 minutes, but that just doesn't seem accurate. So I would like if they could approve on the accuracy of the fitness tracker. I would also like to see it being uh, app enabled or integration with the smartphone. So all this data can then be collected inside an app. Maybe I could use it with like my fitness pal or other apps integration as well, but that is going to motivate people. So, you know, I would like to see a kind of a premium version of this that had that in there as well. I would also like to have different cable um, selection because like I mentioned this cable does kind of hold kinks and bends and if they could just provide a different type of cable that is thick enough that it will go through here just maybe some different type of material maybe one of those speed ropes or even weighted ropes they do have weighted ropes that can help with uh, your muscular endurance I would like to see that as well to come with these ropes. So you have a little bit of rope options depending on where you're at in your jump roping. But if you are trying to lose weight, if you're trying to improve your fitness and you want to find the most efficient way to do it in the least amount of time, burn the most calories, I'm telling you folks, jump rope is the sh I won't say it but it is something that's really awesome. So you should definitely give it a try. And this would make actually a really good entry jump rope because you can track the length of your jump rope sessions, but I wouldn't put too much trust in the calories burned. But nonetheless, you still get your time and your rotations, which is a lot of data. And from there, you can do your own math and figure it out. But definitely, 
If you haven't jump rope since you were a kid, or like me, you just never did it at all, you definitely gotta give this a try. Now is the time. Well, I hope you enjoyed this review of the MSAN Fitness Electronic Skipping Rope with Fitness Tracker. If you liked it, or if you're interested in jump roping, or any questions, comments, please leave that below. If you like this video, subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to follow me online. You can get more information about me at handyandymedia.com. Once again, it's Andy Barrar, a.k.a. Handy Andy, your DIY tech guy. And I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.